what do you do in test execution? So test execution phase in test execution, testers start executing the test cases assigned to them in the test environment, right? So when we say executing the test case, what does it mean? What does test execution means? So if I am the tester in a particular project, okay, and it's a banking project, and I have been asked to test the banking transaction, credit card transaction, debit card transactions, and the transaction test cases are assigned to me. So in that particular scenario, what I'll do is I'll go ahead and then take a dummy card or the number, uh, the card number, the test card numbers, and then I'll start going through in the test environment wherever that particular transaction capability is available, right? So in production, when you are going ahead and doing the transaction, you are going to some particular shop, right? You are going to, say for example, you are going to McDonald's for some food, you are going to some other shop for the food, you are going to some shopping website to do the transaction, right? So based on that, you will tap the card, you will enter the card details and the transaction should go through successfully. But in the test environment, how you are going to make sure that the transactions will go through when this particular code, the transaction code will be deployed in production as well. So that is what test execution phase is all about. So if new functionality, new feature has been developed and it has been assigned to a tester, that feature will be deployed in the test environment first. Okay, that will be available in the test environment that is only available to the internal team and the testing team to test before uh, after testing has been complete and everything is working fine, then the production deployment is made and it is available to the end customer so that they can go ahead and tap the card, insert the card, put the card number and do the shopping accordingly. So to take that example in a little bit more detail, so in the test execution, the transaction, in the test environment, all the transaction test cases that are assigned to me, I'll go ahead one by one. I'll say, for example, verify the transaction or validate the transaction goes through successfully for this particular card at this particular kiosk or this, this particular merchant, right? So the code and everything should be proper. So I'll go ahead in the test environment and put the test card and ensure that when I trigger that transaction, that transaction is basically going through successfully. It is uh, recorded successfully into the database. I'm able to see the transaction record of the amount that have made in the test environment and that data, that amount, that code of the merchant is basically logged successfully into the database, right? So that is what testers do during the test execution. And this is one part of it. This is just transactions testing, right? Now you could be testing something else. So in a high level, what you do in test execution, you take the test cases that are assigned to you as a tester one by one, you go ahead and follow the steps that are mentioned in the test cases and launch the application or go ahead and follow those steps and ensure that the outcome is as expected, right? So that's what is done into the test execution, okay?